here I have Oppo F21 Pro and today I'm going to show you how to lock apps with fingerprint on this device. So firstly you have to go to settings then go to the private passwords and security and add a fingerprint. So let's do it quickly. Firstly you have to set up a lock screen password. So let's do it. You can ch choose different password types like 4 digit pin, 4 to 16 digits, pattern, alphanumeric. I'm just gonna pick the simplest of pins. Then what you have to do is to enter it, confirm it. In the next step you have to scan your fingerprint. Like just put your finger on a scanner here and scan it several times until it remembers your fingerprint. Just a few more taps and fingerprint added. And now when we have fingerprint installed, we have to enable uplock. To enable uplock we have to firstly enable privacy password. So it's like you can set up the same password as you have on your lock screen, you can set up another password. It's for you to choose, I'm just gonna pick the same one. Oh wait, I entered the wrong pin. So I'm just gonna use the same pin as I have on my lock screen. Then you have to answer a security question or secret question. Like it could be your former teacher's name, mother's name, father's name, name of your high school, your favorite restaurant or even custom question. So I'm just gonna give a simple answer. And now when we have uplock enabled here in fingerprint, we go to the privacy. Then go to the app lock, confirm our fingerprint, enable app lock, and now you can lock apps. So let's lock, I don't know, maybe Chrome, contacts, no idea, files, so nobody steal our data, some Play Store, so nobody will install any apps on your device, and TikTok, of course, so nobody will use it. Uh, and as you can see, now I can't open. Google Chrome without firstly confirming either privacy password or my fingerprint. So yeah, the same goes to other apps that I locked. It was Facebook, I guess. Okay, no Facebook today. Contact. As you can see, I can only access them with password or fingerprint. What? Else you should know that that feature works the way that like if you once open this app it will be opened all the time until you lock your screen. So as you can see right now I like lock my screen, then I lock it and apps, these apps are locked again too. So yeah, so easily it's done. And that's it, thanks for watching. If you find this tutorial useful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel.